Hey, yo, it's Fresh Hip Hop Opinion with your guy Elise. And I thought I'd go live right now because there's a little thing that just happened in hip hop. Well, not a little thing, but AZ was on Mav Hoffer's podcast where he was discussing the potential collaboration between this man right here with his man Nas. There's a potential for them to do a an album, basically. Believe it or not, our prayers have been answered. These two, obviously, we know them for collaborating on Nas's album, or Nas and AZ's albums. One of the most, or some of the most notable songs are Mo Money, Mo Murder, Mo Homicide. That was on AZ's album back in the day. Then you got the flyest on Nas's Stillmatic album, which is definitely one of my favorite collaborations of theirs. And then you got the most famous one. The most famous one of all has to be this one right here. Life's a bitch on Nas's album in 1994, Illmatic. Which one's your favorite? Lee, let me know in the comments which one you would find is your favorite one. But then they, they had the album, The Firm. That's with Comega, Foxy Brown, Dr. Dre on production. Jeez. The four of us getting one of those again. If you're a rap enthusiast, there's no way you're not excited about that. But yeah, let me get to the actual interview, what he actually spoke on, on Matt Hoffer's podcast. Check, check, check it out. Can yeah. we ever get an album with you and Nas on some Rain Go shit? Coach Beck. <laughs> if that check me out though, because I want to always answer your questions, right? So, if that was to happen, it probably would have happened already. Cause I don't think nothing so. could hold us back. It's me and him. We I know him. Mm -hmm. He know me. We got paper. Ain't nothing in between us but air, yeah, right? We could do. Right. It would been happen. We don't need nobody to coach us. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Was that ever talked about? We talked about it a couple of times. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You know? Some I don't study at the end of the day. We talk about it. Just, my door open for my people. Yo, I can't believe that it was actually in discussion in the past and it never happened. Who was in charge of that? Steve Stout? What? Listen, that should have happened years ago. It was forever. And that's the answer forever. I was waiting Forever. My door always open. There's never no beef. People try to pull out. There's never no beef. Can never be. Like he put. He brought me to the game. He gave me a platform. You know what I mean? Right, facts. I'm a vet with him. Whatever decision we meant, right? We ain't, we ain't, it ain't always gonna be yes or I'm obligated. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. We're not choir mm -hmm. boys. Do you? Mm -hmm. He know I'm self sufficient. He know me. I know him. He got other battles, right? He got other battles, right? That was thrown on his plate. He got to deal with. Right. I got mines. Once again, so you're the top. I'm gonna do me. And if it happens, that door open and we cross paths, it'll get done. You punish the game one time. <laughs> <laughs> and you know why? Cause that is gonna happen. If they did an album together, listen, yeah, they would punish the game ferociously. All this Jay-Z and Kanye that watch the throne thing and all these other collaborations, they wouldn't even touch AZ. AZ and Nas. Listen, I'm not gonna say that I listen to all Nas and AZ's albums. But AZ and Nas combination as a hip hop fan, I can't even think of another collaboration album that would ever even tip that. Just look, if you can think of one, put it in the comments. I'll take that challenge. I can't see anybody touching that. That's all the little bees up on it. That's what I'm talking about. Shut all, Shut all you little niggas up. That's, not, that's a guarantee. That's not even a thought process. Punish. Mm -hmm. Cause he could do it by himself, I could do it by myself at any given minute. Check my catalog, any given minute. So if it happened, it really be a problem. Do they really want that? That's the real question, right? Yes, yes, yes. Y'all yes, yes, really? Yes, we do. Yes. Powers that be? Yes, do they we really do. want it? You get what I mean? Yeah, buddy. I can see what AZ is saying though. If it was gonna happen, that probably would have happened time ago. Like, 
Az is far from his best right now. Not that he can't rap. Of course, he can still rap and all that. But he's far from his best in terms of popularity. Nas is still. He's got a little, you know, renaissance and all that. So Nas is still good doing his thing. But it would have made much more sense to have done this in like 2003 or 2005 or even before that. Imagine if they made this in the night. Oh, they already had the firm. But imagine they had it back in the day when this was. The AZ and Nas here. This is like late 90s. Probably late 90s, early 2000s max. You know what I mean? Imagine if they did a joint album then, people. But the kind of treat would have been uh, dealt with. Boy. But anyway, you guys, I just wanted to give an update on that because for me, when I heard AZ, well, that question put out there, could they do a joint album? I'd never thought about it before. But the idea of it is just, for a hip-hop head, it's crazy. But yo, you let me know in the comments which joint album would actually get your taste buds going, you know what I mean? Would it be this one or would it be others? Obviously there's other MCs that would be legendary. Imagine if a Nas and Jay-Z did an album together. I think most people would probably say that, but I think stylistically, I don't think that would work. Well, work as well as an AZ and Nas. Imagine them talking about some Queensbridge thing, some Queen stuff. What? What? Fam, it would be a rap. It would be a rap. Yo, people, I'm gonna let you lot go before I do let you go, though. I want to show you some of the merch. It's available right now on the YouTube. Go and get that. It's dispatched from the US, North America. So if you're from America, there's not much shipping fees there. I know you lot hate shipping fees. I hate them too. You got the hoodie there with the little logo. There's more merch coming soon on there as well. So just keep an eye open for all that. It'll be coming soon. But yo, that's it for now, people. If you enjoyed the episode, like I said, get the merch. Or you can do the PayPal thing details are in the description all right but i'm live every day different times in the day fresh hip-hop opinion know what i mean let me just check this for you yeah 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 all right guys oh that's another thing yeah if you do have an idea of who you would want to collaborate in a in a, an album let me know and if you have heard any other hip hop collaborations in the past, I want to know which ones were your favorite and why. Because I'd love to hear your opinions, people. But like I said, tune in next time, people. It's Olize, Fresh Hip Hop Opinion. Tune in next time to the next episode. We come, co we come correct and we come often. All right, guys. It's Fresh Hip Hop Opinion. Peace and love.